you like kicking the crap out of a zombie? Or maybe you prefer to just be spraying your weapon down at them all. You could even just be drop kicking them into spikes. Take that. Nope, get off me. See ya. Or maybe you just want to throw them off a roof. Bye. Well then, Dying Light's the perfect game for you. Because it's zombie killing with free running. Wait, what was that? What is... What? What? And of course, you can level up your character to make him stronger, make him run faster. Loads of different things to help you in the zombie apocalypse. You can also level up your character so you can do awesome moves like this! Hadouken! <laughs> There's also various challenges you can do. So when we get to a checkpoint, so we want to kill a thousand zombies in ten seconds, which is absolutely insane and impossible, but you know, video games. And even when you have leveled up your character to a really high level, you know, you're just going about your business, getting a safe house, when out of nowhere, this guy comes out and kills you. Because yes, lovely. There's various different types of zombie specials, shall we call them, that are around the island. I mean, what the hell? How are you meant to kill him? He's, he's the size of a truck, for God's sake. And of course, if it wasn't creepy enough, you got baby zombies now. Okay, just, alright, it's dead, leave it. Yeah, it's dead. You can also create traps to help you, like this car bomb, where a load of sounds goes off, all the zombies go towards it, and out of nowhere, Houston, we have lift off. Just make sure you're not stood too close to the door, because, you know, knock, knock, who's there? But when it turns to night, I cannot stress how scary this is. I mean... You've got these things chasing you that just jump all over you. You have to quickly run, use your UV light, which you can't get out because you're dead. But, you know, don't you just love it when you just died, you spawn in, you try to figure out what just happened, and out of nowhere, for some strange reason, this rock comes flying at your face and hits you. What the hell is going on? You can also do co-op in this game, so always make sure that you're picking up your teammates and you're trying to kill as many zombies as you can. Like, look here, my friend's gone down, so go to pick him up because I'm a good friend and I... Uh, oh... Sorry! There's also another game mode that you can do while you're playing Dying Light, and that's this Be The Zombie. We get to be this Spider-Man thing, don't have a clue what it is, and basically you have to track down the other people and you have to kill them, and they have to try and kill the hives, and it's just... I mean, look at this. Look at this guy. I mean, you don't just stand in the middle there, do you? He dead now. But when a brand new game comes out, there's a lot of little bugs. I mean, like this one. I, I don't even know what to say. I... Go away! This has got to be one of my favourite bugs. You've got a handgun that's literally three times the size that it should be. I mean, how? How do you get this wrong? What the hell? Alright, cool. Yeah, that was a nice conversation. Let me just go over here. Okay. Why? Yeah, you're damn right. Why? What the hell's this? Okay, then. But well, it's okay, because in a zombie apocalypse, the best thing to keep zombies out is curtains, of course. I mean, how?